Select the angle that satisfies both equations. The sine of x has to be equal to 1 half, and the cosine of x has to be equal to negative square root of 3 over 3. So let me go and place, I'm going to place two equations, two graphs, one for the first one, and one for the second one. For the first one, sine, you need to think, is that your x or your y? Sine has to be your y value. And your y value has to be positive. This is your y. This is positive. This is negative. So therefore, it has to be on either the first quadrant, the first quadrant or the second quadrant. And one half is that your shorter side or your longer side? One half is your shorter. So therefore, your y value has to be shorter side. I'm going to place my two dashes. So it'll be 30, 60, 90. And my two dashes. And since your y has to be your shorter one, if I place it here, your y will be the longer one. So it has to be at the 30 degrees. Or it can be uh, this one here. Your y value is your shorter side. So it can be 150. Now for cosine, cosine is your x. Your x value has to be negative. This is positive. That's negative. So it has to be on either or those two quadrants, quadrants 2 or 3. And it has to be your longer side or shorter side. It has to be the longer side. And then place my two dashes. That was my 30 degrees. And it has to be this angle or this angle below. This will be 150 and this will be 210 degrees. So the one that satisfies both equations is 150 degrees, so therefore it will be letter B.